Hello, welcome back. In this video, let's have a quick look at how to repair your Windows Update. If you're having problems, a lot of people seem to be getting problems right now with the Windows Defender updates or the other updates you're getting error messages over here. Okay, how to resolve it is very, very simple. Okay, the first thing is we need to go to C drive, Windows. Okay, and then we need to find software distribution okay and then download this is all the previous um, updates that have been downloaded don't worry this is only kind of like copies of the downloaded product okay now sometimes if there's an incomplete one over here or there's something corrupted windows updates has issues so we need to delete that okay um let's do it the easy way okay so let's turn on services okay We'll just temporarily disable and turn off Windows Update so that we can delete them because sometimes Windows Update might have a hold on them. Okay, so that'll take a minute. Okay. And at the same time, we'll say you need to download the latest offline definitions for your product. If you're having problem problems with Windows Defender, okay, how do we go there? It's on the Microsoft website, but very simply, all you need to do is type in Windows Defender Offline Update, the very first one, Microsoft.com, so it's the original thing. You're not getting it from any of the other sites. Okay, and then all you need to do is just scroll all the way down, okay, and then download your Windows Defender. Okay, it's take, currently using the 8.1, so it's either 32 or 64 bit, depending on your system. So download that if you're using Windows Defender. Okay, and you're having Windows Defender issues. Okay, all right. And we'll just continue with the Windows Defender idea. Okay, once it's downloaded, you have this little file. Okay, this is basically the current Windows definitions for the viruses, antivirus scanner. So what it needs to do is just install and then kind of like reset the definitions on Windows Defender. Okay. Whilst that's happening, let's go down to Windows Update. Okay. Right over here. Okay. Let's turn that to disabled. Windows doesn't quite like it and we'll try and fight that. Okay. So let's just click OK. Windows Update. Okay. So once that's disabled, make sure it's not at a running status. You can then just delete all of them. And then you need to give admin permissions. Brilliant. Okay. So now that is cleaned up the Windows update folder okay so that's a reset on that now you want to basically bring him back to normal okay you can have it as automatic okay or manual depending on the system let's have it as automatic let's start the service okay and sorry on that one for windows defender we had to run it as administrator Okay, and then after that update was run, okay, basically we have Windows Defender, okay. Now we should not have any problems when we check for updates and install updates. It should all be a problem. If in future you do get the Windows Defender issue, all you need to do is once again go back to the Microsoft site, download your definitions file, and then install it. Okay, and everything should be okay. Worst case scenario, you also go down to your update folder, which is in C Windows. Okay, we'll just show it again. C Windows. Okay. Software distribution. Download. And then make sure you delete all of them. And if you need to, you use services to disable and stop and then restart it and then put it back to automatic. Hopefully this has helped you. Thank you for watching.